Hello, my name is Orlando Cooley and I'm your lead pastor here at the Ottawa Seventh-day Adventist Church. And uh, this is your two-minute drill of leadership for this week. Now, this week is a special episode uh, as we are talking about your place of ministry, your passion, and how God can be reflected in everything that you do. Uh, we have a special guest that we will be interviewing today uh, just to talk about his ministry, his passion, uh, and what makes him so unique uh, here in the city of Ottawa. First and foremost, uh, I'm going to ask him to share his name uh, and what he does here in the city of Ottawa. My name is Emmanuel Mensa, uh, most commonly known as Focus. Um, what do I do in Ottawa? I am a student, so I'm still in school. I'm a brother, I have brothers. Um, I'm a mentor, um, so a disciple. Um, I'm a barber, that's what we're gonna select today. I am also a videographer, um, and I'm a graphic designer, so I design t-shirts, and um, I'm, I guess also I'm an event coordinator. So a lot of titles under the roof, but um, at the end of the day, I'm a worshiper. So the barbershop, that's pretty uh, interesting. That's actually where we met. Uh, and so just let everyone know where your barbershop is. My barbershop is located at 175 Richmond Road. Um, it's in the corner of Richmond and Kirkwood. All right, how long has it been there for? And August 1st will be officially six years. All right, so if you need a haircut, please see him. Things in which I noticed in going into the barbershop, it's not your typical barbershop what makes it so unique what makes it so different um, one of the things that marks our barbershop but we really want is um, there's a song that I was listening to, uh, to by this uh, Christian rapper and um, in the song the theme was it, it's very often that we're introduced into the world the secular world how they do this they do that they do that and as Christians we don't tend to brag on our God anymore. so the mentality was welcome to our world Welcome to the to the sphere of Christianity, where God is placed first, where we don't hit on every woman that comes in, where our, our goal is whether we eat or drink or cut or line up, we glorify God. Till you die to yourself and find for yourself that He's good. You never see with your eyes.